Hello family, how are you doing? I hope that you're keeping well. I pray that you are keeping safe. And today's Monday Musings project is back and I'd like to just have a very, very special invitation today, particularly to those people that have not yet accepted Jesus as their personal Lord and Savior. Today's video is just a special, special invitation to you. Listen, when you become a child of God, you become a co heir of his kingdom. You are called the sons and daughters of the Most High God, and you become the sisters and brothers of Jesus Christ, who will inherit a great kingdom alongside him. And if you have not accepted Jesus Christ, this is a special invitation to you. I'm telling you that you're missing, missing out on a lot. Because you see, the promises of God are yes and amen. We all, we all hear people say that, that his promises are true. They're yes and amen. But what I'd like you to know is that his promises are only for those who are called his children. If you have not accepted Jesus Christ and invited him to come and dwell in your heart, then the promises in the Bible, unfortunately, do not apply to you. That's why I offer you today a special invitation to accept Jesus. The Bible says in 1 John chapter 1, verse 9, that no matter what you have done, no matter how unrighteous you feel, Jesus is ready to accept you. He will cleanse you from all unrighteousness. He will forgive you all your sins. It doesn't matter what you have done. Nothing is too big or too small for him to forgive and cleanse. So I invite you to make Jesus your personal Lord and Savior. Invite him to come and dwell in your heart. He will give you a brand new life. He will give you a life of freedom, a life, a life that is peaceful. You will feel contented. You will, be, you will feel fulfilled in all aspects of life. He, he says in John 10.10 10, that he came to give us an abundant life. And that abundant life is available to those who have accepted him as their Lord and Savior. I invite you to make this decision today to accept Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior so that you can inherit his kingdom and enjoy these promises that he, he will never leave us nor forsake us. The children, because we're his children, he will never leave us nor forsake us. These are some of the special, special privileges that we have as children of God. And he says that we are a royal priesthood, a chosen generation, a special people to him. Only if we are in Christ and we have accepted him in our hearts that these promises will apply. So if you would like to accept Jesus today, this is your invitation. Take this as confirmation for you that God is calling you. Jesus is calling you. He is inviting you to come. Come to his fold. Don't delay anyone one more time. Don't delay any one minute. It is now that he wants you to come to him and give you the abundant life that he wants to give to every one of us that trust in him, that accept him. So you can say this prayer after me. Dear Jesus, today I confess that I have wandered far away from you. I confess that I have lived a life that does not please you. But from now henceforth, I accept you as my personal Lord and Savior. Come into my life and change me. Give me the brand new life. Give me the abundant life that you have promised. And from now, henceforth, I would like to walk in ways that please you. Forgive my sins, cleanse me, Lord, and help me to walk with you all the days of my life. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Beloved friends and family, I encourage you to stay with Jesus, keep walking with him, because the life that he gives us, nothing else and no one else can give us in this world or in the world to come. Thank you for watching. As always, leave me a comment underneath the video. Subscribe to our YouTube to receive more videos and connect on our social media channels to um, follow us and we will be sharing more. Thank you so much for watching and until the next video, stay blessed.